I'm at the house at 6222 Parkland Oaks Drive in the Pheasant Run subdivision. I'm going to give you a 360 of the neighborhood here. This subdivision is just off of Hebner Road between Babcock and Bandera. So you're very close to the medical center. You also have easy access to 410 or I-10. Got a lot of nice landscaping here, mature trees in the front. This is a three bedroom, two full bath, single story home. Square footage is roughly 1,838 square feet. Also I have a Florida room which is not included in the square footage that was added on later. Got the entry here. Okay, we have beautiful stained concrete throughout the living room, dining room, and kitchen. We have cathedral ceilings, lots of lighting. We also have the walls have been freshly painted. Also unique uh, rounded walls here, a couple of them. And also arches. Very nice features. To the right here, we have the uh, coat closet. Again, a lot of the uh, the walls are open up at the top, which is nice. Kind of gives it a more open feel. Got a gas fireplace. Again, is also it's also wood burning. We got blinds throughout the house. Let's go into the kitchen area. Here we have the um, Eden kitchen or breakfast nook area. Again, high ceilings, a lot of uh, lighting. Here we have the utility area, washer dryer hookups, a lot of extra cabinets. The kitchen has some really nice features. We got gas cooking, built in microwave sillstone countertops and also the uh, cab the drawers are very deep so you can fill a lot of big items in there it makes it very easy to store your bigger pots lots of cabinet space deep dual sinks it's just nice to be able to look out to the living room area from the kitchen also have your uh, refrigerator, ice maker hookups. Over here to the right side we have pantry. You got lots of shelves and storage space. And then a second little storage area here. Probably put your spices and smaller items here. Lots of individual shelves. Back here we have the two car garage. We have a garage door opener. Uh, the pink color is not the color of the door itself. That's the, that's the um, insulation tiles that have been put in into the door so that it'll be cooler in the summer and not so cold in the winter, kind of insulates the door. So we got a garage door opener. We got the sprinkler system there, the controls. Got a sink, which makes it easy to clean up. The water softener is not active. And then here we have tons of storage space. So you can still fit your two cars and get all the storage space. There's some more shelves on the side. There is the uh, furnace. That is a gas furnace. And then that door is the gas water heater. So you have all your heating is gas. That should save you some utilities. Beautiful colors here. I'm going to go through here to the formal dining area. Got a bay window, tall ceilings. Should be able to put a, put a pretty uh, good sized table in this area. Then we go back here, 
and this is where the fireplace is. These windows are facing the uh, floor room. Tiled. There is no carpet anywhere in this house. It's all stained concrete and tile. So we have an extra uh, AC wall unit there, ceiling fan, pet door, and there's also numerous um, electrical outlets in this room. Nice covered patio area. Extra storage back there. A dog who wants to say hi. <laughs> Lots of benches and nice uh, shady areas to sit and relax. You also have no back neighbor. Behind you is a green belt. So there's a storage on the right. It's a really nice yard here. Go ahead back inside. The master's is split from the other two bedrooms for additional privacy. This is a very large master's. You could easily fit a king size bed, nightstands, extra dressers. But this also has some built in dressers. So you have a lot of storage space already, already here available. You can put some of your longer items in those uh, taller hanging areas and there's one on the left side there. Get a nice, nice view here of the backyard, very peaceful looking. Okay, your master bathroom is also a good size. You got a separate shower and garden tub. You also have dual sinks. You got a commode with extra extra storage there, and then you have a good size walk-in closet. You got a shoe racks all set up already, and then you got a lot of space here. Got another linen closet there. Bedroom number two. This towel was freshly grouted. Nice high ceilings. It's roughly 13 feet by 11 feet, so a pretty good sized bedroom. Take a look at one of the uh, closets. Both closets are roughly the same uh, between the second and third bedroom. Then you got your hallway bath, dual sinks, commode and tub shower combination. And then the third bedroom. This room is probably about the same size as the second bedroom, about 13 by 11. So again, this is a three bedroom, two bath, roughly 1,838 square feet. Floor to room is, in, is additional space that is not included in the square footage. Nice uh, backyard area, beautiful stained concrete, tall ceilings. If you'd like more information about this home or would like to schedule a showing, you can call me. My name is Mark Fee. My cell number is 210-618-9161. Or you can call the Office of Liberty Management, 
at 210-681-8080. Thank you.